welcome to the Tanya Hoffman's Fabulous TV Show. I am your host, Tanya Hoffman, and as always, I have an incredibly fabulous guest star, Miss Lucy McMonagall. Hey, Lucy. Hey, Tanya. Thank you for having me on here. Yay! So we're going to find out all about her in just a minute, but we would love to have you also go out and change the world from the front of the room by joining the Public Speakers Association. So you can be on my show and you can be on other things that we're doing to make your life not only so much fun, but to get your message out there and heard. So go to Public Speakers with an S Association, all spelled out, dot com and find out more today. All right, so let's get into it. So tell us, Lucy, you have an amazing book coming out. So yes. show it and then tell us all about it. So my amazing book is Magical Money Manifestations, and it is to empower entrepreneurs and spiritual conscious individuals with practical and spiritual skills that they need in order to start creating the money on autopilot oh so obviously everybody who's listening is going to go oh i'm drooling so can you give us like a snippet of what they're going to be learning something that's like so juicy yes the the main thing that they're going to be learning is is really how to not only just dig down deep into manifestations but the book is magically encode it with high vibrational words in a sequence. So as you read it, it's actually going to be unlocking hidden parts of your subconscious mind that's going to start activating your wealth vibrations. And some of the things that they're going to learn is, is the how to really let go of belief systems that are no longer hindering you. But more importantly, how do you find those belief systems if you're not even aware that they exist? And a lot of individuals, they talk about, oh, well, this is just a manifestation thing or, or that, you know, I've read about that. But I actually take you through a step-by-step -step process that I personally went through and I've used over and over again every time I hit up against a black wall. Wow. And... I've gone from dirt poor, being raised on welfare, to being on welfare when I had my first baby, having to choose between eating crackers or feeding my son. And if you're a woman, I know you understand that kind of pain when you have to make choices like that. My son never went hungry. I wanted to give you that because, you know, some people might be wondering what happened. And I went from that to buying my very first car in my 20s and then I bought my first home and then I went on and was able to start manifesting all of the money that I needed in order to live a life working part-time empowering other individuals and being able to live life on my terms I know when you know I first met you I was just enamored by you you know you have such a such a calm personality but yet very hugging and very loving and but yet powerful and I think that a lot especially women have a problem with kind of balancing that yes absolutely and and it's it's really about temperance and learning what you like and what you don't like, and then having this ability to have faith that everything, even the most incredibly trying and challenging situations, like you have had a lot of challenging situations, but it starts building that faith muscle. It, each little increment is like, oh, that worked out a little better than I thought, or it didn't work out the way I wanted it to work out, but then in the long run, this is what happened instead. So when you start having that, that little bit of incremental faith, it starts building and that's what gives you that sensation of, of calm around you. Yeah. You know, it's funny cause people they're like, Oh my gosh, you know, how could you, how did you get to where you are today? And I'm like, you know, there were so many steps. I'm like, why am I doing this? Or why did that happen to me or whatever? But yet it got me where I am right now. Right. Yes. But we can't see where we are right now because that's in the future. <laughs> mm -hmm. Exactly. Yes, that's true. <laughs> so when you start kind of digging in deep, um, are there 
challenges that people run into that keeps them like pushing away where if they just let it go, it's, you know, it kind of flows so much easier. Yes. Yes, absolutely. One of the main challenges that I have discovered that individuals run into is they'll, they'll kind of browse through a book or they'll browse through a website or they'll browse through information and automatically the first thing they think in is, oh, there's nothing new here. Yeah. And when you have an attitude that, oh, there's nothing new here and you're just browsing through this stuff but you're not actually taking the time to read it because it might have a key in there that, you know, it one sentence out of an entire book might change your entire life. Now, my goal is that there's lots and lots of sentences in my book that will change your entire life. But even if just one sentence was able to catapult you in the direction of your sole purpose to bring your greatness into this world, that would be well worth it. Yeah, because what I think is that a lot of times people, you know, if they hear you on stage or they read your book and they're like, wow, that was really neat, but they don't implement any of it, right? Oh, yes. And then they're like, well, see, that stuff doesn't really work. And I'm mm -hmm. like, well, you didn't even try. <laughs> exactly. You know, you do more than just try, you have to actually absorb yourself into it, right? Correct. And in addition to absorbing yourself into it, is, is keep working at it. If you just kind of half-heartedly try something, you'll half-heartedly succeed, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> and if you really decide before you do anything in your life, I'm going to keep an open mind. I'm going to do the best that I can do. And most importantly, even if I flubber it all up, even if I completely fail and I get so frustrated that I want to throw a book down or throw this down and jump on it for a little bit, I'm still going to continue to work through it until I finish. And it's, it's a very short book. I've kept it under a hundred some pages for you so that it's not this big elaborate workbook or anything like that. It's, it's easy. It's an easy read. And it also has exercises and fun to do different things so that you can change your perception on what is wealth, what is money, and not only that, you can also change your perception on anything. You don't have to use money. You can say relationships or you can say, you know, some other aspect that you're having a challenge with. Oh, I love it. And, you know, it's kind of like when I just went to L.A., just got back at 2 o'clock this morning. <laughs> it was like people are like, oh, my gosh, you know, you're, you're already going, but there's so much fun in life, you know, and mm -hmm. it's just kind of your perspective, you know. Um, you know, I got to bed, woke up, you know, and ready to go. And, but a lot of times people look at the, all the negatives and they, and they have this stop mentality, right? Mm -hmm. And they use excuses and I, and you're probably like the perfect person that people call you, give you a million excuses why your thing doesn't work, right? Well, this manifestation just doesn't work. And, and it's all probably internal the fears and the anxiety and uh, challenging myself. Um, is there like one thing that really, if they would just like let it go, it would be so much better. Absolutely. The one thing that they can let go of is the boogeyman that's hiding in their mental closet. Wow. And I explain on how to do that in Ooh. my book. Nice. Okay. So yeah. So obviously everyone, you have to just go get her book, right? <laughs> I am dying to have it. And so you've got like this whole process going on where you're going to have it in Kindle and then you have it in book, you have it in Spanish, you got a program coming out and you're like got all this juiciness that I can't wait to be a part of. So yeah. kind of explain, you know, what is that all going to look like and how can we get and take advantage of it? Well, the, the best way you can take advantage of it is first get the Kindle version because that's going to be coming out and it's only going to be 99 cents for the first week or so that it's out. So you can afford under a buck to find out how a powerful this is going to change your life. The second thing is, is give a shout out to your friends and your family and, 
yeah, social media, let other people know, hey, I just bought Lucy McMonagle's Magical Money Manifestation book, and it's really awesome. I just started browsing through it, and I've already picked up some tips. So let other people know, and make sure you go back to Amazon and give me a five-star rating. Nice. Oh, and I just love it. So how do they get all that information so that they don't miss out on anything? So if they want the book and they want to be able to sign up for the bonus gifts that I'm giving with the book, they can go to Magical Money Manifestations. Dot com that's all one word it's the same name as my book magical money manifestations so it'll be really easy for you to remember the website nice all right everybody so you need to just jump right now get off of here go over to there because you know you want to buy today it's available right now so jump and if you're watching this like six months from now go to it now because you know you want to. Um, so money, no, what was it? Magical money. Magical money manifestations.com. Perfect. So do that. Get connected with Lucy. She's amazing. Reach out and say hello to her. Follow her on social media. You know, it's all about the connection factor and having fun. So you want people like Lucy, in, obviously, in your back corner. Um, and, you know, just to have as a new friend or a colleague. Or, you know, you probably want to go, hmm, maybe I just should hire her and help her help me. Because <laughs> you do that too, right, Lucy? <laughs> Absolutely. I am a Mystic Wealth Creator Mentor, and I do work with individuals that are ready to really go beyond the 80000 a year to six figures and multiple six figures. Nice. I know some of you are going... 80,000? Yeah, you can do 80,000 too, people. Come on, we got to have some fun in life. So yeah, fantastic. Absolutely. All righty, everyone. So go and check out Ms. Lucy right now. Grab her book and then, you know, keep in touch with her because she's got so much amazing things coming out. And then also go by publicspeakersassociation.com and get connected with me. We'd love to have you be a part of the association so that you can go out there and change the world from the front of the room as well. Thank you, Lucy. Thank you, everybody. We will see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye.